Welcome to Getting Started with your Alarm.com system. In four easy steps, this tutorial will cover the basics of the Alarm.com interface and walk you through the setup process so you can begin monitoring and controlling your home remotely. This is your system homepage where you can configure and control all the aspects of your account. The tabs at the top of the screen is your toolbar so you can navigate to different features. Beneath the toolbar, you'll find more options for each tab. The Feature Usage bar shows you the percentage of your system's capabilities you are currently using. Watch your feature usage increase as you move through this tutorial. Whenever you log in, you can just click on the bar to make sure you're getting the most from your system. A user code is a number that you assign to each person you want to give access to your home. Users can disarm the system and even unlock doors if you have connected locks. Here's how you set up a new user code. From the Security tab, click on Users and then on Actions on the right-hand side of the page. In the drop-down menu, select Add User. Fill out the details for the user and be sure to include name and contact address, which can be a mobile number or email address. Now you can assign user privileges. Click the Panel Access icon at the bottom of the screen. You can type in the access code of your choice and then click Save. Just repeat the steps above for each user you'd like to add. A notification is the system's way of letting you know when something happens at home, like a door opening or when a particular user arms or disarms the system. To create notifications, navigate to the Notifications tab on your toolbar. Hit New Notification and click through to see all the notification templates you can choose from. Click on a notification to review the details and add people by clicking Add Recipient. The Add User window will allow you to select any of the users you set up in Step 2 or add a new user to receive notifications. Click Save to activate the notification and repeat the steps above to configure additional notifications. We recommend receiving alarm notifications and adding someone you trust so they're notified if your alarm goes off. You can always come back here to edit or add a notification. The fourth step is downloading the mobile app. The app lets you quickly send commands and manage your system from wherever you are. Once you've downloaded the app, you can log in with the same login you used for the Alarm.com website. Your account is now fully set up. Stay safe and enjoy using your new system.